second night I've dreamt about you, babe I don't know how I should tell you, babe But lately I get lost thinking about you I admit that I can't be without you The air that I breathe doesn't mean nothing If you're not here, giving me something I can hold on to Baby, please don't leave Chale, welcome back to Ghana. This is my favorite country in Africa. Leave a comment. Let me know which is your favorite country in Africa and why. Why is Ghana my favorite country in Africa? Well, there's just so much to love about Ghana. I like this one. Uh, hey, my friend. Hey, you want to try the hey, other one? Okay. Yeah, mommy, the other one. Medasi. Okay. <laughs> you tried. Yeah. <laughs> so this is ten cities, five cities. Ghana money is so and colorful. Yeah, one city. This is the smallest. Not really the smallest, but the the paper. This is the smallest denomination. Your president introduced a new currency. currency. Yeah? Oh 200, yeah. I, I, I don't have that at the moment. But the biggest is two hundred. Two hundred and hundred. Oh. <laughs> yeah. Guys, you see how I'm keeping up with Ghana? You know these things. I'm telling you, I know these things. <laughs> So we just stopped by, was was stopped in traffic and um, I saw a lady selling this, what do you call it? Plantain? Plantain chips. What's the local name? And we just call it plantain chips. Plantain, plantain chips. chips and I, I've got, I had to try 21 in um, Nigeria. Like We used to eat this like every single day. It was extremely tasty. And they've got like two types. You have this one that is... Um, the ripe one. Oh yeah. This one is ripe. Yeah? It's very sweet. Yes. Maya loves this. I find it too sweet. I love this one. This is in tribe. Oh my god. When you come to Ghana, make sure you give this a try. This are like my favorite snacks in Ghana. Yeah. So sometimes when you even go to the restaurant, they, they serve this with um, peanuts. Oh, yes. yeah. Ghanaians love taking it with peanuts. I like the way you always keep your, your subscribers like involved in everything like i learned that from you because oh really yeah when are you supposed oh. on youtube if you check my old videos when i get to a place i'm like okay yeah we are here see the place and then that's it but you give a full detail like oh okay i find this attractive oh guys what do you think about this place like yeah that's, that's a how typical you, like, you. <laughs> guys interactive yeah or you say oh guys how do i look and you be telling always me, always, like, always. <laughs> even i have a, i want to come down and ask them how i'm I don't even know what I've just done, but I just just go with it. You already know that on this channel we love to show you beautiful destinations, you know, places that you should visit in each and every country in Africa, and that's why we're here. Second night I've dreamt so to go for the ride you have to pay 50 ghana cities which is about nine dollars first you come into a room like this um where instructions are told to you examples and open door shoes are not allowed close shoes are mandatory <laughs> about my channel in case you don't know what that means it means welcome in ghana yeah. so today i'm with this fine girl at like this Chale. stella chanelli Yay! <laughs> i'm so happy Aww. miss judy i'm happy to meet you too finally Aww. if you guys watch my video yeah and i learned a lot from your channel though oh thank Aww. you <laughs> So if you guys saw my video where I was talking about my favorite blogger, she was one of them. Yanni, I just love her so much. I'm so humbled. Oh, Aww. you're welcome. Let me give you a kiss. Aww. No hobo. Charlie. Before they come at you. Charlie. 
me, 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 I didn't do anything. Oh, she did it. Anyway, I'm so happy to be here. She's brought me to this house party go kart. So we are going racing. I'm so excited. Thank are you so winning? much for bringing. Me. Are you winning? What are you saying? Is that I'm a question? Of and course, you know I'm the winning. good part. We uh, we are going to bet. Mm -hmm. So she's going. To, she has money on her. Mm -hmm. Thank God she had some Ghanaian currency. We are going to put money. Ghana CD Charlie. They will see who wins. What are you saying? Are you, you are, you're ready to, to lose, you. eh? Oh, you're ready to lose. I'm ready to milk you today, ah. <laughs> Charlie. You don't know who you're talking to. <laughs> I will show you, you guys. I, I'm having mercy on her, you know, and you haven't even started because you're going to see dust. Oh, you're your going to see dust. <laughs> Morning when you were coming, we were talking about how uh, Ghanaians love exaggerating. So hey, <laughs> hey, we are going to see I'll that. You ha. Ha. Exaggerate the oh, A. Over my board. <laughs> See, over my chalet. <laughs> anyway, on a serious note, um, we are we are getting ready to go go cutting. I'm totally excited. I really can't wait. Stay tuned in. And now this is definitely another place you totally visit whenever you come to Ghana. Somewhere to come and let loose with friends and family. Welcome. Welcome guys. I, I really hope you like this video. If you do, make sure you subscribe. Give the video a thumbs up. You know, leave a comment. And share. Let's see 200,000 subscribers. My Ghanaian people. Where you dig? Miss Trudy. Yes, so. How excited are you? Extremely excited. <laughs> How, how about you? And I'm going to beat you, so I'm so excited. Are you? <laughs> Guys, I pity this girl. Oh. Charlie. Charlie. Look at you. I, I, I'm looking at you and I feel, I just feel bad for you. Because when you finish, you won't be smiling. <laughs> oh my God. When I'm done with her, she won't be smiling like this. So. Sorry? I don't understand. <laughs> oh, I need to tie the hair. That's what yes. you're trying to tell me. Medasi. <laughs> Finally! Guys, so this is so much fun. I lack words to express, how, you know, to express how much fun it is. But the saddest thing is that you're only given eight minutes, you know. Go as many rounds as you want, but it has to be within eight minutes. But I think it's worth it. A few moments later. So we are back from go cutting and um guys you clearly saw I won. Oh guys <laughs> I hope she doesn't edit the videos. I won drastically. I won. I won your ass man. Tell yeah. your Kenyan Actually, you know, I was winning and okay, then I happened? think she had a deal with a guy who was like How uh, will I have a deal when I have the car? Stopping me. You're seeing me ahead and you're stopping me, you're stopping me. How did you're I telling stop him to stop me all the time? So to be honest, so he I won. stopped us both because our braids were coming in between our necks, and he said it's not good because the braids can actually turn like this and actually choke us. So he kept coming to tie our hair for us. So that was why he stopped. I'm sorry, baby. Girl. So that's why she she passed me for a couple of minutes, you know. But I was winning, guys. You know, truly, gang, we are like the winning team, like all. The <laughs> <laughs> Let me just end it. 
So about five minutes drive from the go-kart, uh, we have this beautiful beach that is said to be actually one of the cleanest and one of the most beautiful beaches in Ghana. <laughs> Welcome to Bojo Beach. This place will make you fall in love with Ghana. Beautiful, guys. Oh my goodness. Look at this. So we just got here and I'm loving what I'm seeing, you guys. I I'm Stella Chanelli guys and I'll be grateful if you can also join my family you know you know your what Trudy gang yeah <laughs> how do you address your subscribers Trudy gang gang Trudy gang <laughs> gang gang <laughs> so yeah I will leave her link in the description box make sure you check it out and subscribe to me So Ghana's coastline stretches for about 560 kilometers and along this coastline it has very many beautiful beaches. This no doubt is one of those beaches that actually stand out. First of all it actually is divided into two. So um, once you come into the beach you have to take a small or a simple boat ride to the other main side of the beach very unique very different and makes this place very appealing so they have a volleyball court they have a river view restaurant and of course swing for kids to play so come let's go we are kids too right so we can play <laughs> One of the things I found most unfortunate about this place is that you have to pay to enter. Um, but the good thing is that uh, it's not very expensive. The entrance fee is about 20 Ghana cities, which is just $4. I feel once you pay and you get in, you feel like it's actually worth it. So the thing about Ghana, Accra, is that... Um, beaches are all over you know unlike other countries you don't have to travel you know days or hours to get to a beach you know they are there and they are just spread all over so this beach is just within accra and it took us about an hour to get here probably because you we were stuck in traffic we could have gotten here much earlier um yes and the thing that is most impressive is how clean the beach is. Of course, today is a weekday, so people are not so many. Look at Stella. Have I told you your swimming costume is everything? Whoa! And oh, your light line is so good. I know, yeah, right? They are glowing. I know, right? <laughs> My camera just went off. I had to switch to my phone but I'm loving it so So after a day packed with lots of fun you know I was extremely tired and it got extremely cold and um we had you know something that I'll never forget we just sat next to the beach and ate so I tried some Ghana food, Banco and Tilapia. And the best thing about this place is that, you know, they have fresh fish straight out of the sea onto your plate. So the food was really fresh. Um, very different from what we eat in East Africa, but nonetheless, um, worth trying. <laughs>
and that's it guys thank you so much for watching i really hope you liked this video if you did please give it a thumbs up leave a comment let me know what you think Ghanaians in the building please drop a comment let me know uh your favorite beaches you know which beach would you recommend for a foreigner to go to leave a comment and let us know thank you so much for watching Mwah. bye mm.